get the impression it's going to be the hardest thing I've done in my life, perhaps. Wish me luck, I was just about to go up the second summit, scrambling up. Hopefully I see you on the other side. Just making his way to the third summit on the ridge. So that's the uh, exposed bit. Yeah, that's a bit of a dodgy section. Well, there's a little bit of exposure just gone past. Just parked in uh, a lay-by on a uh, country road at Rear Dew. Uh, ran pay six pounds all day. Uh, over in the car park or beyond it. The plan today is to do the uh, Nankley Ridge. Not the full ridge, the seven on the full ridge. We're going to do a circular walk and hopefully do four. Uh, just to have some good views. This is those clear tops and half decent day. So we'll see what we're doing so I can see uh, the Nankley Bridge just in front of us. Uh, Yagan is the first one, I'll pronounce that one. Uh, the other three I'll just call Summit 2, Summit 3 and Summit 4. Looks like there's some spots of rain around, but there's blue sky and uh, sunshine. So hopefully I get lucky with the weather. So for me, it looks as though it's going to be a bit of a slog, but I think once you get up to the, uh, the first summit, it's uh, quite a bit easier. Snowden and looking that blue sky just over there. There's all the bridge that I'm doing. So we're uh, just making the way up to so the first summit on the Berkeley Ridge. Just checking those glorious views behind me. Uh, to come on this walk and it packed off just for midday. Uh, I did a uh, Pifelli Power Run this morning. That was pretty tough. We were also on the time. It's basically running up and down, five kilometres up and down the beach, so on the sand. But uh, no one I've been keen to return to. I'll turn me. So, just uh, looking around at the views. That was a bad idea. I think we're making fairly good progress. I think we're going to up. About halfway up. Just taking a breather, wind's going up a little bit, but uh, most of all the rain is all good for now. It's a little shiny. It's a little bit of climbing today, quite a bit, over half, well over halfway now.
Looking off the back of you, Gan. Great views. See miles. You have to see. Beautiful. So I'm going to have to do it only two because I'm not going to have to embarrass myself. So that's where I'm off next. Summit number two. Summit done, you can. Now heading off to Summit number two. As I say, I'm not going to embarrass myself and try and pronounce it. So making my way up to uh, Summit number two. So I get the views out to see my little blue mug on there. Doing a bit of scrambling to this second summit. I uh, get the impression it's going to be the hardest thing I've done in my life, perhaps. It's a bit daunting from that there, but we'll see. Wish me luck, I'm just about to go up the second summit, scrambling up. Hopefully, I'll see you on the other side. I got the eye rate up, it wasn't too bad. Well, you, you do see me on the other side. Uh, that was. A lot easier than it looked, so it get, sort of got in my head on the way to it that you know it was going to be really tough. Uh, so I was in the best frame of mind going over it, but it was fairly straightforward. Nothing too uh, too bad about it. Beautiful views off this uh, this walk. To nearly at some point too now. Views of some point number two. Just making his way to the third summit on the ridge. Come behind. See the ridge has been over. It's beautiful views all around. Just looking over the ridge, I just Shelter here, it's out of the sea. Beautiful 
Ooh. Too far from me third summit. It's just up here. Kind of stop, stop it. Look at the views. It's a bit of a drop to one side here. Yeah. It's not massively exposed. Almost at the third summit, it's like uh, some footage towards the second summit of the ridge in the sun. It's been quite fabulous. So I just walked across and uh, went down through the path down into the later. Just uh, this way, third summit, just here. Uh, I walk across the ridge to see the one with the big peak. This is the uh, third summit. It doesn't have a curtain or anything. So this is it, the third summit. Some great views. Views of the third summit. I'll label it down below what it is. You can try and pronounce it yourself. It's out to the sea. Fabulous views. You can see our next summit, the big beacon over yonder. So I think the uh, that bit of the ridge has been done. And it wasn't too bad, if I'm honest. The, the uh, third summit here is you know, fabulous views out to sea in all directions. And a fabulous day out. bits to uh, get across in this little uh, downward section. So just had to negotiate a, a little uh, section with a little bit of exposure. Just have to be a bit careful when you're you putting your feet, etc. Maybe not too bad. So, I was just making my way up to the uh, final summit that I'm going to be doing on this circular route on the Nankley Ridge. Here we are approaching the uh, last summit of the day on this uh, Nankley Circular. Hike. It's quite an impressive beacon. I it's 18 feet tall. I don't think I'll climb up on it. There we are. Taking in some of the views. leaving the uh, fourth summit now, the beacon, making my way back to the car. So I'll go through that little dodgy exposed bit. And after that I think that's the uh, hazards done. Just need to find the path down. find me pass down. So that's the uh, exposed bit done. It's a bit of a drop 
to one side, just to have to be good. And, uh, I'm just making my way back up. Let's get off this bit of a narrow bit. But yeah, that's a bit of a dodgy section where you have to be a little bit careful when you're putting it. I'm not going to go back up. I just need to find my pass. Pass down to Reardoo. Oh, the country lane at Reardoo. Well, find my pass down is easy enough to find after all. So just dropping down this uh, steep path now. That's the car. I don't think there's any dodgy exposed bits anymore, so all the hazards should be cleared for the day. and uh, Snowden in, in the background. The rain seems to have stopped now. Still checking the views in. I'm uh, making my way down this little banking back to the car. I'm going to Bagellet Forest soon. Back on the ridge on Snowden. I get the forest looking spectacular in the sun. Beautiful, clear day, clear views. What can you ask? So I thought the exposure was over with, but there is a little bit of exposure just gone past. Just have watched your step. Rolling down that hill. Right to it. So there's some cracking views though on all the lower slopes now. You can see where I dropped down just over there. There's a fact you can see people walking up the hill there. You can see the silhouettes. You see the ridge has just gone a bit across and over to the Snowden. Up uh, behind that uh, bit of water down there, whatever its name is, I'll pop that up on the screen. Beautiful views on. Well, just had a bit of an adventure. Uh, we across that boggy field, there was no obvious path, so I kind of uh, missed the path, so I ended up going. Country through some forks and mud. Uh, but eventually, I'm onto the proper path. So, let's just follow this path back to the car. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Nice waterfall. Not too far from the car now. So I can see Mount Snowden in the cloud now. And you can see our packing area down below. It's always a good sign. So I should be back in the car in a quarter of an hour or so. Where I was this morning. That's where I was up, UK. 
Ridge walk circular complete. Seven and a quarter miles. 2,750 feet of climbing. And four and three quarter hours. So a good day out. And some super views. Just what you want. <laughs> 